Welcome back, survivors. Disturb Z here, and we are back in Timberborn. All right, guys. So let's see what do we have today. Today, today, today. So the beavers are still placing dynamite. They've almost got this finished, so that we can blast it down to that bottom level. Just a couple more pieces to go. What do we got here? Let's see. Seven of them? Yeah, it looks like there's seven pieces left. There's four beavers, five, six. Need one more. Uh, yeah, we need one. Oh, no, no, they got it. I think that is all of them. Yes, that is all of them. Ha ha. I don't know where that last beaver was, but he was apparently down there somewhere. But anyway, that's great. So we've got a bigger, deeper um, thing to pull water from. Unfortunately, we can't go any deeper than that. But, you know, it is what it is. How, how many blocks deep is that? That's at least three blocks deep. Good. All right, we've got two days left. We're at 2.4 thousand on the water. We've got 2.2 thousand food. So we're looking all right on that. And yeah, we're just kind of, we're just doing things. We're waiting, we're doing things. We're getting our dynamite over here so that we can get this all blasted out. How much dynamite do we have left? We have 35 pieces of dynamite left. That's not bad. There's probably more than 35 spots up here, but that's okay. They've got a good amount of that going. So anyway, uh, so a couple of y'all had suggested that we go ahead and start plugging up some of the uh, some of the exits to the map and getting some of these areas, you know, situated a little bit better. And I like that idea. I do. So I think that's what we're going to do. I am going to bring us a road over and I'm going to bring, I'm going to bring this guy down. Like so. So if he goes down, he can make it all the way back to here. I'd rather him go all the way to the very, very back, but I don't know if it's, I mean, is it really necessary? It kind of is, kind of isn't. I'm going to do it just because I like to have it all the way at the very back. So that's what we're going to do. We're just going to run this all the way back here. And I'm going to put in two levees right there. Actually, I'm going to put in three. Well, do we really need three? I mean, it's going to go over the edge anyway. Uh, let's just do two for right now. Let's get that all the way done. That way, if any water comes over here, it will... It will get pushed out and then the next one let's see I want to make sure we get all of the exits covered there is another exit <laughs> way back here uh, let's see do we have this exit cover yeah we have that one covered up in the front um, and then we have another one way back oh, wait is that a water source hold up I didn't realize there was a water source back here Ooh. We need to get we need to get back here and fill this. That's what we need to do. Okay, so how are we gonna do this back here? Let's see. We've got we've got to get to this level, we've got to get to that level, following it around. This is over here. Uh and then that is right there. Okay. Alright, so what we could do is we could do this because I have to get it. Yeah, we're going to have to get further back in there. <sighs> so frustrating. So, so, so frustrating. Alright, so let me do this. Let me grab one of these guys. Put this guy down here. This is the greatest part about not having district limits. We can just run these things. Now, the bad part is, is it's going to take them forever to get this done. But we should be able to get at least to right here, and then we'll be able to continue on from there. But we'll let them, we'll let them work on stuff. The water should be flowing again. The water is flowing again. All right, so we've got that. Uh, how are we doing over here with this? It's too far, can't be reached. 
Okay, I'm going to go ahead and detonate this. Bring that down. And then I am going to what? You know what? I think I think I'm going to do this. Yep, we're going to bring it all the way down. That way we can continue to work on stuff even out there. So that's what we're going to do with that. So, but anyway, we've got more water ret uh, retain re retention, retaining, whatever you want to call it over here. We got it down here as well. We're waiting on it to get to this point. That is good. Once it backs up. Oh, yeah, we're going to have to raise this up is what we're going to have to do. Let me give it a second to fill this up. That way we can get water back here as well. All right, so while we're doing that, let me pause it here for just a second. I want to come back over here and look at this guy. So this guy is filling up back here at this crater. Okay, let me, let me unpause that. We're going to let it, yeah, because it can flow, it can flow up here, and it can flow down here. Yeah, we're going to have to get it sealed up at the very back. That's all there is to it. Uh, they have not got to that guy yet. They have gotten to this one. You know what? That's because we don't have... Now are we good? Now they can reach it. Okay, good. So we'll do that. And then let's see. That will run down here. Just trying to follow it. We're going to have to run a path out here. Okay, we can make it down to this. Technically, well, no, that's the first one, isn't it? Yes, no, we've got to keep going. I was going to say technically we just have to get this one, but no, it, it'll still come down here. So we'll do that. I mean, we're right here. Yeah, do that. Okay. So yes, so that'll be that'll be one of those if we can get the beavers over there, get it built. It'll take them it'll take them forever to get that built. It really will. So hopefully we'll be able to get some other stuff going before then and redirect some beavers and all that other kind of stuff. Now, let's see where are we at. We need I need to do this. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and set this to 10. And then I'm going to set this to the lowest priority. That way, if any other jobs come up, the haulers will uh, switch off and go over there. So we've got that. We've got four builders, four builders there. I'm wondering if I need an extra four builders. That's kind of what I'm, I'm wondering right now. Do we need to, do we need to increase that? Did they come over here? Yes, they did get that built. That's excellent. So that one is sealed. This guy is filling up over here. Beavers are running down here. I don't know how far they're going. Oh, no, they're making it. They're all the way down to here. Okay. So they still got a little ways to go before all that. Now, 
I guess, I don't know. Part of me, I know we're not going to get it done before the end of this uh, wet season. That would be, that'd be, that'd be a little too hopeful right there to get that done. I mean, I know we still got this area down here to seal up, but as long as we got more water flowing over here, I think it'll be fine. So, you know, if we could turn this into a giant reservoir, that'd be kind of cool. I'd probably hold some water, too. And, yes, of course, our our water, our thingy, our uh, drought is coming back full swing. All right, so this is what I'm going to do down here. I think these little barrels, I'm going to go ahead and get rid of them. I don't think we need them. They only hold a tiny bit of water anyway. I'm going to get rid of those guys. I'm going to put in a medium barrel right here. But instead of doing water, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to do medicine. I want to get at least one medium barrel of medicine built, built, done, whatever you want to call it. Uh, let's do, where's our gatherer at? Hold on. Is that, that's you? Yeah, you still got room. Okay. So let me do this real fast. Let's grab some more dandelion. I'm going to put you right there and I'm going to put you right there. Seven more plants is not a whole lot, but that, you know, almost doubles it. I think we had like 10 original, so it's pretty close to doubling it. So that should help us get more medicine situated. So we'll do that. And now that we've got, hey, we've got extra beavers, so now we can start doing the corn stuff. So where did I talk about doing corn at? Let's see, we've got a farmhouse right here. And I could do it down here. That wouldn't be too big of a problem if I did do that. You know what? Let's do this. Let's... I'm going to blast this right here. Hold on. Let me raise the priority on this because I want this focused on first. Well, I say that we have a water dump right here, but yeah, this will be, this will be good too. We'll blast out a spot right here to hold a little bit of extra water. So many different things we're trying to get accomplished in such a little bit of time. I don't know, I'm considering adding in another builder's hut. One of the other things I was considering doing, just so that we have a little bit faster uh, response time from the builders. Because I don't know where they're at, what they're doing. I might even do another hauler too. Oh, did those get finished? That one got finished. Yep, get all of those going. And then I want corn. I don't know how much corn we actually need, but I'm just going to go ahead and do like corn all throughout here. And we'll probably, you know what, I think we're going to get rid of these berries as well. But before we do that, I'm kind of thinking about doing like a big storage just so we have a massive amount of berries for later on. Uh... Let me see. Yeah, we could probably do that. Let me see where we're at down here. Have they have they worked on this at all? They've got that done. 
They have started on that bottom, on that bottom ladder. Yeah, raise the importance of that. How are we doing on planks? We got 220. That's not bad. Not bad at all. We've got 35 dynamite, which I'm going to go ahead and detonate that. And before I forget, let me, let me raise that up half a block. That way we got a little bit more water stored in there. Nice. All right, we got the farmhouse in place. We've got corn coming in. That's great. Now we just got to get some warehouses built. So I think we're going to give it a couple of days just to kind of let them finish up that dam project over there because all of our guys are going to be running back and forth quite a distance to try to get that built. So that's part of the reason why I wanted to get the other, the other builder hut so that we have four extra beavers to accomplish stuff i kind of wish there was a way that i could designate a builder hut to like focus on closer projects but i don't think there's anything like that i do not believe there is so anyway 27 day drought almost as bad as the last one we've got 4.3 thousand water stored away We've got the deeper channel here. We got this blown out just a little bit here. I'm going to go ahead and detonate that just to get that down. Uh, we've got this deeper one over here. So we have, we have the ability to retain more water. So hopefully, hopefully they'll be able to pump a lot longer into the dry season than what we had last time. So we'll see though. We'll see. These guys over here, nice. They are getting this built. That's great. I like it. Even if we just get that one level built, that would, well, I'd say that would do something. That would hold water here. That's not going to do anything. So two levels will get us to here, which means that's still not going to do anything for us. Oh, that's so horrible. We're going to have to go up a third level before it will do anything, I think. All right, we'll get it done. We'll get three levels done that way. That's the that's one level here. That's two levels here. The third level will be here, which will bring it back to here. Okay, so it's still going to escape, but maybe, I don't know, maybe maybe it'll go the other way too. We might have to go up to another level. I think we will. Oh, well, either way, one step at a time, get this done, get our, get our projects built. Let's see. So we got all that and let's see where are we at with stuff. What is this one? That one is also water. Yeah. Y'all keep, y'all keep getting stuff pumped for us. Okay, so storage, 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 storage. That is where we're at. Okay, so this is what I want to do. Before we go and build good storage, I want to... You know, to be honest with you, I'd rather dynamite right here first. Yeah, dynamite that. That way we have another another water source that we can pull from. Or well, not pull from, but another water source to help keep crops 
going. So how much corn do we get per crop? We get two. Oh. Two corn per 10 days. You know, I was kind of thinking the, the corn crop would have been a little bit higher than that, but yeah, I guess it is what it is. You know what? I'm just going to go ahead and say, let's just get rid of the berry bushes. I was going to try to collect them, but I think that's just asking too much right now for all the projects we got going on. Let me just clear those out. Yeah, we'll clear all those out. We'll get more corn planted. We'll do things. Yep, go ahead and raise that one up again. No! It dried up. We're only 24 days in and that one dried up. That's not good. Well, you know, it could be better. It could be better. So I'm wondering how we have, let's see, basic hunger and nutrition, corn ration. I was going to say, is there a different value for each one of the rations? But I guess if it's a corn ration and then an eggplant ration, we'd get different bonuses out of it. So, I think it might have answered itself. Is that, no, that guy's not in there yet. Here it goes. Go ahead and detonate that guy. Awesome. Put that one down. All right, one more big storage for water. Go ahead and raise the priority on that. I want them, that one's going to be a little bit more important to hold in more water for us. We've already got this one up two layers anyway, so that's fine. One step at a time. Okay, so all of that's done. Oh, yeah, I guess I need to raise the uh, priority on that platform too, don't I? All right, so why are we only at 17? What are we missing here? We got a little bit of injury, a little bit of wet fur. I need to get I need to get showers put in place. I do need to do that. Uh, let's see. We'll have corn rations at some point, so we'll get a bonus off of that. Campfire. We've got like three or four campfires. That should be higher than what it is, but I don't know why it's not. We need roof bonuses. We've got a little bit on the statue, a little bit on the shrub. Uh, we've got a little bit on the Lido and then the shrine. So we need more shrines as well. Okay. So there's still, there's still stuff that we can add to raise up our thing. I'm all right with that. I was kind of hoping that the rooftop terrace and campfire was going to be a little bit higher than what it was, though, considering we have three of each. Oop, we got this done. Let's see, there's some corn right there. Go ahead and throw that in. We got one more bush in the middle that we need to get rid of, but that's okay. They'll get to it soon, hopefully. Planks are in here. Gears. We have enough gears and we have enough metal blocks. Excellent. They still working on this guy. Uh, 
Okay, so yeah, they're they're working on this stuff first. All right, that is fine by me. We are up to five point six, five point seven thousand. That's that's pretty good for water. Got another twelve hundred. That's gonna get here pretty soon. Just kind of curious here. Are those pumps still? Yeah, those pumps are still working. They still got water down in there, so that's good. Those are still working. These are still working. These down here are still working. Yeah, we still got pumps for a couple more days. All right, so that's not too bad here. All of that's looking good. All we need to do is, let's see, hold on. My last corn right there. Get that in there. Okay, so all we have to do over here is we just need to add in a uh, power wheel to help supply power to the building. And then we should be good. So, let's see. Yeah, let's go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and just, oops, wrong click. Hold on. Right click. There we go. We'll do that. 50 power. How much does this one need? 120. So that'll partially do it. But that's okay. We'll worry about getting it up to full power later on. At some point, we're, we're going to get the batteries and everything else going. And hopefully the water wheels will help charge the batteries. Makes things a little bit more effective for us. All right, it's nice. So they do got this going. We're up to 5.9 thousand. Great. Does that mean they went back to work over here? They did go back to work over here. Okay. It's going to be kind of pointless to have that done if we don't have a block right there. So we'll let that get done and then we're going to try to see if we can take care of some stuff over here at the, uh, at the city before we go any further and any, any higher on what we already got. So I think for the most part, we're good though. I think on water storage, we're almost where we need to be. I mean, we are increasing our beaver number. So having a little bit extra storage isn't going to hurt us at all. In fact, you know, that extra 1200 will probably come in handy, I bet. So. I bet it will. Alright guys, well I think that is going to be it for today's video. We got a little bit of stuff done. We got... Some more storage in. We blasted out some more spots. We got that little, this little area back here, uh, a little bit more situated. So slowly but surely, we're sealing up all the exits on the map so that more water stays in the current map. And yeah, hopefully, hopefully it works out to our uh, to our benefit here. But. Anyway, that's going to be it for today's video. I do hope everyone has enjoyed it. If you have, be sure to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, do me a favor. Hit that subscribe button. It is an awesome way for you to show your support to me, to the channel, to the video, and to the game itself. And as always, feel free to share the video on any social media you're using. You guys just like to stop, take a moment, and thank each and every one of y'all. For all of your wonderful, awesome support, all the comments, all the likes, all the subscribers, and all the videos shared. It is awesome, and I do appreciate it. And with that being said, until next time, survivors, keep on surviving.